From Television City in Hollywood, it's the Wayne Brady Show. Wayne's guest king of fudge, Alexander Black, with perfect Valentine's candy. Welcome back, everyone. Now, you know that we've been telling you how to uh, have the perfect Valentine's Day. Now, a box of chocolates on Valentine's Day is nice, right, ladies? It's very nice. <laughs> Look, it's nice. But wouldn't it be great to surprise your mate with some homemade fudge? Huh? Yeah? Come on now. Well, my next guest, the creator of the award-winning Fudge Fatale, is going to show us how. Please welcome the Fudge King! Alexander Black! Hello, sir. We aren't making just any old fudge today. This is a very unique fudge. Uh, this is not the kind of fudge you're going to roll out on a marble slab. It's not. We're not going to add marshmallow cream. We're just going to cook six ingredients. Okay. You're going to cook six ingredients. Okay, bring it. You're going to put those ingredients in that pot. Go ahead. Just um, the, in any particular order? Nope. Just put them right in there. I put that, the chocolate that's in first. Unsweetened chocolate. Unsweetened chocolate. Nice European unsweetened chocolate. This is cream. That's have evaporated milk. Mmm. Some milk we, on top of the cream. We'll talk about heavy cream later, but this okay. is sugar. Just sugar. Good old granulated sugar. I can't wait to eat this. Hey, everybody, look at the show. <laughs> and butter. Two, oh, the butter. Oh, oh, so this is the healthy chocolate. <laughs> yeah, just put it in my veins. This chocolate is good. My heart stopped. <laughs> okay. okay. Just some water and, and corn syrup. Just pour those in. Water and corn syrup. I'm assuming the. Uh... I'm true to the recipe. This is exactly what I grew up making. Okay. The corn. Corns. Okay, there we go. It's a group effort. There it's a we group. go. There we go. Tag team. Okay, there we go. All right, brother. All right, stir. Okay, let's stir S this up. Six ingredients. Ah, uh, that's really easy. <laughs> I feel like a captain of a ship. Quickly, bring her about. This is. A, you make this by hand, man. Yeah. Okay. A lot of it every day. So, so, this is wow. And you're gonna just cook that for about an hour, but we're gonna move. <laughs> Real fast. Yeah, we have TV time. We're gonna fast forward now. Okay. Let's pretend an hour went by, about an hour and a half. Ding. Okay. Exactly, because this thing actually makes a ding sound when it gets to a certain temperature, and now oh, this is the same ingredient. Ding. Okay. <laughs> so, so what's the origin of fudge? Because everyone loves fudge, but, but, but where does fudge really come from? What is fudge? Fudge is actually the only American chocolate we can call an American invention candy-wise in America. That's right, baby! <laughs> it, it really is. Fudge, fudge was actually without chocolate before it became fudge, and they say a couple of college women in the turn of the century came up with some chocolate ideas to add to panucci, which is just basically butter and, and caramel. I mean, butter and sugar made into caramel. But anyways, we just got a wonderful old-fashioned fudge recipe here that I grew up making, and it is truly a dark chocolate decadent fudge. <laughs> yeah. Okay, so that's uh, so. But basically, what you so just done. So now the fudge, it's all stirred and packed. Absolutely, what we just done is you've just stirred this along and you've turned this into a 230 to 5 degree temperature. And afterwards, what we're going to do okay. after this gets to 230 degrees, right after you get that off, is you're going to pour it into that pan right okay. there. Got to pour some fudge in the pan, yo. There you go. Look, there we go. Oh, that looks yeah. really, really nice. And then what you end up with is le voila. Oh, look at this. Yeah. So this is a great way for, for all you single guys, you can woo girlfriends with fudge, much like I heard, heard that you've, you've done in the I've past. actually spent many years making this fudge. And by the way, while you were making that, mm -hmm. we also could have added heavy cream and turned it into a hot fudge sauce, which oh. is the ultimate fondue, ultimate hot fudge sundae, oh, all those can things. can we dip stuff in the fondue? Absolutely, which cool. is right here. So oh, now you've got you've got one of those guys. Oh yeah, we have strawberry. No, way, Brady. Oh, strawberry. <laughs> so should I dip it here? Either or one, either one. Go for some, that, because that's nice just, and warm. Although that is too. Yeah, but you know what? It's not right that I sample it. Um, can I have a volunteer from the audience? A lady? Can I get a lady up here from the audience? You right there in the front row, ma'am. Come on down. I think I. Man, I think I murdered the strawberry a little bit. I... You could go for another one and grab the stem and then... No, I can't find the strawberry. Where is the strawberry? <laughs> We've lost the strawberry, quick! Get the Navy Seals! I'm sorry, I'm gonna hold it by the uh, There you go, stem. that's the way to do it. No, and then just... But I'm not gonna feed it to you, because that's too romantic. You need to... You need to feed yourself. Grab a little bit of that chocolate. Poke it, poke it. 
The poke it with the spear. I will say, poke it. Well, you gotta pick it up. Is it good? Eat it. That's good, huh? Take it back to your seat. Oh. So, what this, this is all about making a dark, poorly decadent chocolate fudge and packaging it in gorgeous black velvet so that you can woo anybody. It already is an, a, an aphrodisiac, as we all know. It affects the brain. It makes you feel good. It makes you feel loved. <laughs> And it was my dream to make the best chocolate I ever, I ever grew up with. So well, I think that you have achieved your dream, sir. You make some of the best chocolate. And if you want some, it's, it's packed in these wonderful glasses. This is the ultimate chocolate sauce right here. For the recipe, log on to fudgefatale.com. Or if you're too lazy to make it yourself, order it online. <laughs> Thank you so much, the king of fudge. Folks, we, we also have a piece of fudge for everyone in this audience. Alexander Black will be right back. Thank you.